get popped! Oh, you're gonna be so cold! So, we're here, Polar Plunge. I feel like we're a mix of the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade and the Olympics. So tell us about the Polar Plunge, what's it all about? Well, the Polar Plunge is a national fundraising event for the Special Olympics. So that's the real reason we're all here today is to support this great organization. And it's just a crazy, really fun, exciting way to raise money. Butler has supported our group for probably the last 20 years. So when you guys decided to do a plunge, we thought we'd better plunge here. Best program in the state, right Grace? Zay. Best Why? program in the state. Zay. What do people have to do for the Polar Plunge? They have to raise $50 for if they're a student or $75 if they're a community member. And they come out here, put on a funny costume, and jump into the lovely pool we have outside. And um, I'm not sure if you guys know this, but it's about 20 degrees and it's snowing. It's just cold. And we have an epic event going on, the Polar Plunge. Let's jump into the coldness for a cause. <laughs> Let's see what's up. Come on, Tony! Be a PD. Coming as the Copsicles. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm cold watching. Oh. 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 That could take gold. I feel like this would be something you just have to run, don't even think about. Go through it. Here we go. Lucky charm going and. Oh. Without getting the hat wet. Oh. Well, that's very hard to do in this kind of competition. You tell no lies. Splash them. We should have prepared for that. Iron Man's here today as well. Didn't know. Oh, secret identity right there. We know who the real Iron Man is now. And Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> we only like Sonny. <laughs> oh, and with her famous swan. Oh! Oh my gosh. I've seen few people do that. That move's called jubilation. I think that was called starfish, or maybe shark bay uaha. How you feel? A little, bit, a little bit bruised, a little bit cold. What did you have to mentally prepare for this? Just not thinking about the pain. <laughs> All right, fair enough. Was it painful? Yeah, it was painful. Like pushing your eyes back in your head when you flop. How was it? Really cold. Really cold. All right, I won't ask you any more questions. Yes. Are you freezing yeah, for? What was the reason? I don't know. Something. Feels good. Kids were helped. Something. I'm cold. You have ice. <laughs> so how was it? What do you think of it? It was fantastic. It was. You guys look so warm right now. It's so cold you're warm? That's called hypothermia. Now the real question is, does clothing help? I know a lot of teams bring different outfits, but then again, is it better just to go skin? I feel like it's really up to the participants to decide. It really comes down if you want to have flair or if you want to have speed. Oh, she seems to have kept her little flippers on. Look at look at the little mini pools that they had set up. They have a small layer of ice on them already. Look at this. These are not natural noises coming from these people. It's like, can I survive this day after this jump? Oh, there was that, that was a cool effect with the hat right there. I thought it was fun, and it's really not that cold. All right, well, I think you're the only one that thinks that. I feel great. I feel rejuvenated. I'm so excited to do this for Special Olympics. Let me tell you what. This is a great cause and a great event. Thank you guys for hosting.